Now let us follow the lineage of the lymphopoiesis with the lymphocytes at the end. So it starts with the hematopoietic stem cell, but this time uh, the next stage would be the lymphoid common progenitor cell. And uh, it differentiates into B lymphoblasts or T lymphoblasts. And these lymphoblasts will mature into corresponding lymphocytes, so B lymphocytes or T lymphocytes. I'm not focusing on morphological details now because the main processes that occur here in gain getting the immunocompetence in acquiring the immunocompetence are related with expression of some surface molecules, etc. Another lineage separate would be the one leading to natural killer cells that look like large lymphocytes. Okay, so these are these azerophilic, azerophilic granules. And although it's not part of lymphopoiesis uh, anymore, let us remind of the fact that the B lymphocytes are entering the tissues. And differentiating into the plasma cells with their eccentric nucleus with a clock phase distribution of chromatin prominent granular endoplasmic reticulum which is responsible for the basophilic properties and these are producers of immunoglobulins and are called plasma cells